Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Will Motivation and today we are going to do my Ram TRX monthly payment video. Probably first things first, what we should do is a cold start before we get into that monthly payment. Let's do a cold start. So here's a key right here. Double tap the remote start. Uh, man, I'm out of gas. It probably ain't gonna do it. It's gonna stop probably. Hey, you know it's a cool feature on this truck is those marker, side marker lights. Those are dope. LED, look, it stopped because I'm almost out of gas. So we're gonna also find out how much it costs to fill this thing up. But there's some cool lights. Let me see if I can get it to start again. There's some cool LED lights right above. Nah, see, you don't wanna start for me. I'll show you guys once we get gas in this thing. I'm gonna get it washed as well. But this is gonna be a fun video because a lot of you guys probably have seen on YouTube these monthly payment videos from YouTubers with Lamborghinis talking about the monthly payment or Ferraris or Porsches sitting in their garages or out and about talking about the monthly payment on those exotic cars. Well, guess what? The way that I got my first big like boost of subscribers where I went from like a few thousand subscribers to like 30,000 subscribers was because I was the first person on YouTube to do the monthly payment video on a Lamborghini. And then after that, you started getting all these YouTubers doing monthly payment videos. And guess who started it? I started that, all right? So that's my claim to fame. And to all you OG subscribers who um, signed up or subscribed to my channel when I did that first Gallardo monthly payment video, well, you guys are the OGs because I was the first person to do a video like that. And wanted to thank you guys for staying subscribed. But for all the people who are watching this for the first time, you're interested in the TRX, I'm gonna go over my um, monthly payment. I'm also gonna go over the specs and options that I have and the total sales price and how I pay for this Ram TRX. One thing I like about this, it's got the friendly open with the key, you know, the remote key, and my key is in my pocket. This truck is huge. Key is in my pocket, so it's got push button start. Show you all these features that I'm using to get this truck started. Other thing I'm going to use real fast is um, Homelink to close my garage door. Garage door is over there closing. So yeah, so this is my Ram TRX. I just got it. It's a 2021. The baddest truck on the planet is the 2021 Ram TRX. But let's get right into it. Let's talk about the monthly payment, how much I pay every month for this truck. Using my reverse camera, using my four wheel drive over the snow. All right, so one thing that was really popular on my, on my first monthly payment video was getting right down to the point. And you know, for those people that, that tune into this video to find out how much it costs to afford a Ram TRX 2021, um, I like to get right down to it. So here we go. The cost of my spec for my Ram TRX was $88,000. All right. Now, when you start talking about monthly payment, um, you got to know how much money somebody puts down and, uh, you know, all that good stuff. So I'm going to give you two scenarios because the monthly payment for me on this truck is actually zero dollars, right? If you wanna be technical. I actually wrote a check and paid cash for this truck, but hold on, don't tune away. You know, don't, don't leave yet, cause I'm gonna give you the monthly payment. If I did finance the truck, and I sorta of financed the truck, so this goes into how I'm able to pay for this truck, cause this is an expensive truck. My, this truck was $88,000. I wrote a check, paid for the truck cash, but I'm gonna explain to you explain to you how I did that. But first, let me tell you what I would have had to pay if I financed it. So if I put roughly 10% down on the uh, on the truck and I financed it for 60 months, the payment would normally be 1,450 bucks roughly, or a little, little bit less now, but about 1,400 bucks uh, plus or minus, depending on how much money you put down, that kind of thing. But for five years or 60 months, 1,000, 
$450 roughly to finance this truck for five years. Now, like I said, I have a zero payment on this truck because I wrote a, truck, uh, a check for it to pay it in cash. And if you're wondering how does somebody um, write a check and afford to pay that kind of money to put down on a truck, well, I'm a business owner and uh, an entrepreneur. I'm also an investor. And what I did to fund this truck is I used my real estate. So the check that I wrote to pay for this truck, I wrote that check from what is called a home equity line of credit. And that home equity line of credit is not on my house, but on, of my, on one of my investment properties. So I have like 20 investment properties. Um, I'm a software engineer by trade. Started a business, business started doing good. I started investing in real estate. Real estate started doing good. I started selling some real estate, paying off you know some of my existing uh, real estate that I kept that, that are rental properties. And so when you pay a property off, then you can tap into the equity of that property and get basically a checking account and you can basically use the equity in your real estate now that sounds complicated don't worry i have a um i have a real estate investment course so if you want to learn how to invest in uh, real estate leverage your real estate that kind of thing to buy you know the toys and have the real estate pay for the toys that's the second part is the reason why i say i have i pay zero dollars a month is because i have a tenant in that real estate that's renting out that property and they make a monthly payment to me to rent that property and then I use that money to pay the loan um, on that on that property or that on that home equity line of credit. So I really don't have to pay anything out of my pocket to uh, to have this truck. I just went to the bank, said, "Hey, here's my property. You guys can open up a line of credit against it. I can use it. So when I sell this truck, then I'll just take the money from this truck, pay pay off that uh, loan, or if I keep it, you know, my tenants will be paying. You know, let's say they stay there for three years or whatever." If I used all the money from that rental income, then I could probably pay this truck off in, in three or four years um, through that rental income. It's not costing me anything. They're just using my property. I'm using the bank. I get the truck. I keep the house. And when the truck is paid off, guess what? I still get the income from that rental property. So that's how I'm able to afford this truck. Um, I'm, like I said, I'm a real estate investor. I'm an entrepreneur. Um, there's, I have a variety of ways I really could have paid. I could have financed the truck. I could have, um, I could have paid, literally could have paid cash for it, but sometimes it doesn't make sense to do that because what I like to do with my cash is I like to have my cash readily available, available to buy other investments that will make me more money than what I have to pay to the bank in interest. That's what I like to do. So there you go. That's the monthly payment. Monthly payment. If you were to finance this truck and put like you know eight grand down, roughly. Your payment would be about $1,400 a month for this truck for a 60 month period. But if you're a real estate investor, you got some real estate, you got equity in the real estate, you can tap into that equity, buy your truck. You know, hopefully that property is making you some money, use the money from that property and pay off the truck. So there you go. That's my little five minute spiel on how much you would have to pay monthly for this truck, but how I actually, you know, leverage my real estate to not have to really pay anything to drive this truck around. Next thing we're gonna talk about is the spec. So let me get this uh, this vehicle washed up real quick. And hold on man, I know y'all wanna see me, y'all wanna see me get into it. Let me put this mug in, um, in sport mode real quick. All right. Damn. <laughs> Yo, all my gas is probably gone right now. All right, we're gonna we're gonna launch from this light right here. Let me show y'all what it looks like real quick. All right, hopefully there's no cops around, but I'm gonna launch the truck for you guys when this light turns green. So get ready. All right, we're gonna leave this car in the dust. Watch. Ooh, we got a little chirp. Damn. God dang. Yo. Yo. I left them cats in the dust. <laughs> Yo, this truck is nuts. All right, let me get this truck a bath. Then I gotta run to the gas station. So we're gonna see how much it costs to fill it up. Then I gotta run to Lowe's because I'm hanging a TV for the Super Bowl. 
Um, and then uh, and then I'll talk about the spec that I have for this truck. All right, let's go. All right, guys. So I just rinsed off the truck so you guys can get a better look at the beautiful black. Um, where that pickup comes in handy right there. Somebody's running up on me. I just washed the truck. We're going to take a good look at it. Um, this is my first time filling the truck up. You know, so we're going to see how much it costs to fill this truck up. Let's do it. Alright, we always get a receipt just in case the cops stop us for any kind of mistake. You know, it's Black History Month. I'm teaching y'all how to be black. Uh, 93 Octane. One thing I like about Ohio is we got these little, these little notches so we don't have to sit here and hold it. You just sit here and watch the, the uh, meter run, or since we just got the truck washed, there you go. This is what it looks like when it's clean. Like it's nice, crispy. Ram TRX 2021. Beautiful black on black spec. There's not a lot of options that you can get. Look at these shocks, man. This is crazy. Look at that. Bilston shocks. Man, it comes with everything you need to go off-road. <clears throat> thing I like about this for me is I do a lot of road trips. I'm not, you know, I'm not afraid to get in the car and just drive, like from Ohio to Florida. And this truck, I can feel confident jumping on the road to do a road trip. I mean, it even has the extra spare tire, which is a knobby tire, you know what I'm saying? You don't have to worry about getting caught in a snowstorm. You don't have to worry about getting caught in a rainstorm. Or you know, being comfortable having four or five people in the car. This is a really good you know vehicle. So I was debating on whether or not I was going to keep it. Not sure if I was going to like it, but it's looking like a keeper right now. Um, so y'all stay tuned because I'm going to do a lot of video content with it. But next stop is Lowe's. But on the way to Lowe's, let's talk about the spec on my Ram TRX. But yeah, we gotta. I gotta give you guys how much gas. So so far we're on. About $35. My guess is it's gonna take, it's gonna take 70 bucks to fill this thing up, my guess. Hey, but did you guys see how this thing took off? I'm kinda willing to bet, I bet you in a short race, this truck could beat a lot of sports cars. Drop me a comment if you guys think we should race the Ram TRX black on black with my black on black Ferrari F12. I know the F12 will take the, the truck in a long distance race, but in a short distance rate, like a short distance race, like an eighth, an eighth mile, could the Ferrari or could the Ram TRX beat my Ferrari F12? Drop a comment if you want if you want to see that um, race on my on my channel. Yo, it's still going, man. Dang. So we got like a 30 gallon tank, apparently. Alright, dang. $80 to fill up the TRX. This thing is still going. Oh my god, bro. Dang. Yeah, okay. It should stop here any second. Third, it took 30 gap. What? I was getting ready to run out of gas. Yo, we took 29 gallons of gas. Alright, it's full, it's full. $85 to fill up a Ram TRX from empty. Dang. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Next question is gonna be how much does the gas cost in Ohio? $2.86 for premium. There you go. Okay, so let's talk about the spec on my Ram TRX. What made my Ram TRX jump from 70,000 to 88,000 roughly? Cost my truck. I'm gonna go through the main features of the truck. And if you guys wanna see any of the features, let me know because I'm going to do a review of this truck. And in the review, I can talk about and cover the features that you guys care about. So definitely let me know. Um, I mean, this truck is ridiculous. Wow, somebody just cut me off. Okay, so let's talk about the spec on my Ram TRX. Package level is TRX level two equipment group, which is essentially um, you know, all of the major features that, that you have in the car, such as the navigation system, the Apple CarPlay, um, the trim level of the way the, what, way the car looks. It's got the Harman Kardon um, sound system in it. It's got the red trimmed leather seats it's got the heated seats it's got cool seats or ventilated seats 
I got the um, home link system. I got the reverse uh, mirror camera. So this mirror actually serves as a camera. And like I said, I'm gonna do a review on the truck um, to go over all that good stuff. But it's a level two package. So that's basically the, the, the top of the line um, um, package. The other thing I did is I got the advanced safety group, which is your blind spot monitoring system. I think that's like, I think that should come on every car now because it's just gonna help you out and prevent accidents. I also got the bed utility group. Um, I got the heads up display, sort of like the um, Chevy Corvettes that have the heads up display. I got that on my truck. Diamond black, that's pretty much a standard color to black. Um, I didn't get any, I didn't get any extra stickers on the paint, but let's see what else I got for interior features. Um, the Harman Kardon uh, sound system with the 12 inch display on the Uconnect. Um, the dual pane sunroof, that was extra. So I, so I added that, the red access in the interior, the safety and security system with remote start, park sense for, you know, the, the parking sensors, um, surround view camera. So that's a big deal. So when you're parking, you can, there, there's a surround view camera that will show what's on every side of the vehicle. Um, and that's also good for like rock climbing and all you off-road guys that use that stuff. Um, I just got it cause it came with one of the packages I selected. Um, but yeah, blind spot and cross path detecting. So if you're backing up and there's a car coming from far away that's gonna, you know, get in your path, then it'll let you know and it'll, you'll get some notification about that. But anyway, man, when I do the review on this truck, I just want to quickly go over that so you guys know why my truck costs eighty-eight thousand dollars. But when I do the full official review, which I might do this weekend um, uh, and release it during the week, then you guys will see, you know, the full initial honest review of my Ram TRX Hellcat truck 2021 so stay tuned for that if you're a truck fan also I just got a new project truck so if you haven't seen that video I am building a pickup another Ram pickup truck that only cost me about ten thousand dollars and I'm gonna try to build that truck up to compete with the TRX at least in the speed department to make a truck as fast as the TRX I'm talking about doing an engine swap on it I'm talking about hooking it up it's a truck right so you got to put navi tires on it you got to put the the, the the big lip on the rims you got to go 18s or better on the um, wheels so i'm doing all of those mods uh interior mods exterior mods i might even put you know red guts in it who knows so stay tuned for that build if you like trucks um and we're going to try to make that truck faster than the trx by throwing a 6.4 liter hemi engine in that truck so stay tuned make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. And look, if you um, wanna see more videos and you wanna see me do certain things in my videos with the cars or the trucks, drop me a comment and let me know what you wanna see in my videos. And for those of you guys that wanna be able to afford you know, trucks like this, you wanna learn how to invest in real estate, check out the link in the description of this video for my online course on how to invest in real estate, where I teach you guys everything I know about investing in real estate and uh, building a multi-million dollar real estate portfolio. All right, so check out that uh, link in the description if you're interested, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. It's the one and only Floyd Money Mayweather. I'm here to tell you guys to go to Wheel Motivation. The exotic cars is crazy. I've been watching this show for a little while now, and it's growing, but we need everybody else to subscribe to Wheel Motivation and support Wheel. I'm supporting them, you do the same.